Warriors glide into position for the opening draw. The Blue Jackets start with possession as we are now underway. The Oilers gain possession in their own end. With some open space at center. And he takes the feed. Pat save. Oh, he got all of that one. First Lickens is going to hang on for a whistle and get a breather here for his team. That guy start to run around. You get a little weary. That's an important cover. We're still in the early stages of this period. The game is still scoreless. Buck is dropped and we are back underway. Sends it over to Goudreau. Poked away at center by McDavid. The Blue Jackets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Columbus on the attack. And it's a quick pass to Wierenski. Back at the point, they set it up. Edmonton's grabbed a hold of the puck. The Blue Jackets have it against the wall. Picked up along the boards by Roslevic. Into the offensive end now. Dropped him in the open ice. Here they come on the attack. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Taken by Voracek. He carries the puck up along the wing. Dumps it in. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Puck grab by Gavrikov. And some good footwork to kick it away. Nice feed. Puck scooped up by Voracek. Moves it quickly over to Nyquist. Edmonton's got the puck. And it's kicked away. And some nice footwork to free the puck up to his teammate. And he slides it quickly to Fogel. Nice poke check. The Blue Jackets gain control of the puck against the wall. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Breakaway! Oh, did he ever come up huge between the pipes? What a save! This is a real strength of the goaltender, the one-on-one -on -one battle. He gets out, focuses in on the shooter, takes all the room away and makes the stop. And just gets a piece of that one to keep it out. And he came out and challenged a good save. Lots of time left in this period. We're still scoreless. Ryan's won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. Couldn't make the connection on the play. The Oilers scoop it up along the boards. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Coming to the slot. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Moves it to Fogel. Puck picked up by Bean. Quick pass over to Goodbranson. The Blue Jackets have it now. Tries to get it over to Goodbranson. Poked away in the neutral zone by Clefbaum. Dumps it into the other end. Handles the pass. Quick pass to Corelli. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Pushes it across to Yanmark. Sends it in deep. Good fight for the puck along the boards. The Blue Jackets gain possession along the wall. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Passes it to Bofus. Here's a short pass to Corelli. Into the attacking area from the left side. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Corelli. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Robinson. Quick feed to Shore. And they send it right back to him. Slides the puck to Kane. The Blue Jackets have it against the wall. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Back to the point it goes. Great chance and an even better save. Moves it quickly over to Murray. 
And now he moves it to Nugent Hopkins. Made the stop on that play. They are really feeling it now here in the Ozone. Right into the net. And there's the save. And there's the whistle as the goaltender will hang on and give his team a breather. Nearing the midway mark of the period. Still looking for our first goal. McDavid's won the draw, and they'll look to set up. And he takes a shot, and he shuts the door on that. He's only one goal away from his next real achievement. You know he'd like to get it here. He's in, all alone. Denied! I don't know what more could be done there. That's a good shot, but the goalie makes a great stop. Goalie with a stop. Merzlikens gets on top of the puck, and we'll get a whistle. Everybody on the ice is gassed. He's probably gassed, too. Now you can get a drink of water and reset. And the setters glide towards the dot here as we got a face-off set to go. Edmonton's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Moves it to Nurse. And that caroms off a body in traffic. Through center along the wing. Pokes the puck away. The Blue Jackets scoop it up along the boards. Quick pass to Sillinger. Poked away at center by Barry. The Oilers cross the line and gain the zone. Skates to the crease. First goal just past the midway mark of the first. Pretty tight first 10 minutes now. They get the jump, and they'll look to expand that lead before the end of this first period. Nugent Hopkins wins the draw inside the neutral zone. The Blue Jackets get a hold of the puck along the boards. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. The Oilers look to start the transition game. And he slides it quickly to Nurse. Edmonton's through center and now in the offensive end. And now it's grabbed by Sillinger. Taken by Nurse. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Moves it on over to Johnson. He scores! That's two in a row! They got the first one and I was really interested to see how they would respond. They kept the pressure on. Edmonton's had this game circled on the calendar for a while, and they came ready. You can circle it, you can think about it, but then you got to execute. This has been a fantastic start. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Manages to hang on. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. From one point man to another. Merce Lickens gobbles up the puck, and he'll wait for the whistle. Oh, now you got a chance to get organized again. The freezing is a good safe play. Past the midway mark of the frame, Edmonton's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Columbus plays it along the boards. Dumps the puck in. Taken along the wall by Hyman. Sends the pass over. Here's a shot, and that goes off course off a of body. Here's a short pass to Fogel. With possession along the wall. Quick feed to Murray. Shot, gets a glove on him to make the save. Merce Lickens off to hang on to it to get a whistle. You start to wear down a little bit. You need your goalie to help you out. Officials have got both teams ready, and it looks like play is set to resume here. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. The Blue Jackets get a hold of the puck off the draw. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by McLeod. Now a quick pass to Line. There's the physical side. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Turns it aside with the glove. That's a great A chance, and the goaltender beats the shooter with the glove. Dead center turned away.
McLeod's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. Centering pass! Another pass! Here's a shot. Great save by Merzlikens. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Janmar. The Blue Jackets have it behind the cage. Beautiful feed up ahead from the right wing side. The Oilers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Line. Edmonton's got it against the boards. McDavid's got it in the offensive zone. Stones him in front. The goalie reads his play really well. He gets out aggressively to make the save. That's a low slot shot. It happens quick, but he's in the right spot to make that save. Late goings of this period. Edmonton's got some breathing room as they lead it 2-0. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. Benstrom's lugging the puck. And he takes the dish. Grabbed along the board by Benstrom. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Merce Lickens has the puck, and he'll wait for the face-off. I think that's a pretty heady play. There's been a little bit of scramble around him, and he jumps on it. They can get reorganized. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Answered the call on that play. Good save. Positional save through traffic. And they'll dump it in. Both sides digging in for that puck along the wall. Great defensive play to break it up. That pass doesn't go. Edmonton's got the puck in their own end. The Blue Jackets take possession in the neutral zone. Gets the puck in deep. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. And now he moves it quickly to Kane. Moves it quickly over to Boquist. Can't make the connection on the pass. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Directed over to Fogel. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Moves it to Bead. Columbus with possession in their own zone. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. And he puts that one aside with ease. Campbell's gonna cover up the puck here for a whistle. He makes a safe play and kills the play before any other damage can be done. Edmonton's won the draw. Slides the puck ahead to Ryan. Edmonton's got it in the offensive zone. Columbus moves ahead with the puck. Here we go, on man rush here. Scores! Oh, what a shot! He got all of that one. Here in the late goings of the period, Columbus still needs one more goal in order to even things up. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Quick pass to Ryan. And that's broken up. And nearing the final 60 seconds of this opening stanza. Columbus has it in the open ice. Stretches one out to Nyquist. They put the puck into the offensive end. The Blue Jackets gain control of the puck against the wall. Great defensive effort with the stick. Loose puck battle along the boards. Up along the wing. McDavid's got it against the boards. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Tries that last move. Maybe he should just shoot the puck or get deep. Got a chase now. Moves the puck to Dreisaitl. And that'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of action here tonight. We've got lots more still to come. Second period is just around the corner. Fans back in their seats. Teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Ray, 20 minutes into this one, what do you make of this one so far tonight? The Blue Jackets are looking for a little bit of good news while there's 40 minutes left. 
Other than that, James, it hasn't been a very good start for them. They didn't have the puck much, no possession time, and now they got to climb back into the game. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Poked away in the neutral zone by Yamamoto. Poked away at center by Boudreaux. Edmonton's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Here they come. Moves it around along the half wall. Turned aside with the glove. First Lickens is going to wait for a breather as he swallows up the puck. Well, now everybody can get themselves back to their square one position. I mean, it was starting to look a little ragged in the defensive zone. It's a good play by the goaltender. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. And he takes the feed. Puck grabbed by Wierenski. Dishes it to Kane. The Oilers are on the attack. The Blue Jackets have it from their own end. Here's a short pass to Voracek. Edmonton's got the puck along the boards. Nice pass. Quick feed to Voracek. And not much on that one. Feeds it to Kane. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Pass broken up. Sends a pass over. Nyquist crossed the line and gained the zone. Tremendous read and even greater sacrifice on the block. And the puck's kicked free. And here's the pass to Fogel. Dishes it to Kluffbaum. Tries to get the puck to Bouchard. Slides it up front. Sends it into the offensive zone. The Blue Jackets gain possession along the wall. Columbus has it behind the cage. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Oh, what a little stick lift on the play and comes up with the puck. Poked away in the neutral zone by Ryan. Gets the puck in deep. The Blue Jackets have it against the wall. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Hyman. The Oilers played along the wing. Moves it quickly over to Hyman. Great poke by Fogel. Takes a shot. Stopped with the waffle maker by Merzlikens. And it's freed up over to his teammate with a nice kick pass. Slick feed. Moves it to Kulak. Cuts to the front. Denies him in close. The Blue Jackets have it now. Peek's got a hold of the puck behind the net. Right through center and into the offensive zone. And he regains control of the puck. Puts it on net. Oh, tremendous stop of the play. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll be forced to tag up. Quick pass to Bemstrom. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in the open ice. The Blue Jackets scoop it up along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Bemstrom. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. They'll dump it in and peel off for a change. And that pass doesn't go. Oh, they had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Here's a short pass to Corrali. And now he angles it across to Line A. Play whistle dead, penalty coming up. While their lead now depends on their penalty killers as they're shorthanded after that penalty. It's the first penalty kill for this team tonight, guys, and we know their unit, it's ranked towards the bottom of the league, but this team's confidence can sometimes overpower the skill that they show. So let's see what they can get going here right now. Scooped up along the wall by McLeod. The Blue Jackets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Can't make it work. Oh, what a save by Campbell. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Goudreau's gained the line and on the attack. Quick feed to Line A. And not much on that one. Edmonton.
Washington's got possession while undermanned. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Shot! Toe saver! Was that the blade? No, regardless, tremendous! Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Musa quickly over to Nyquist. The Blue Jackets played along the boards. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Sends it ahead to Yanmark. Great read in the offensive zone by Voracek. Edmonton's in now. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. And now it's grabbed by Texier. Scores! And just like that, we are all tied up thanks to that power play goal. I mean, the goal's awesome, James, but they had to earn that power play. They had shift over shift, started to put a little pressure on, felt like there was going to be either a goal or a penalty. They get the power play and then don't miss. Columbus will go to work as they win the draw. Moves the puck across to Sillinger. Columbus looks to attack. Grabs it with the glove. Campbell's gonna smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of a puck. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. We got a tie game. McDavid's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Edmonton's in on the offensive attack now. Takes the feed. Here he is in front. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the paddle. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Works it across to Dreisaitl. Grabs control of it at the point. The Oilers move the puck in the defensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Dreisaitl. From the slot, left save by the goalie. Flashes the leather, right in the slot on a difficult chance. More than half the period has expired. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Oilers will go to work here in the offensive zone. Great save by the goaltender on that one. The Oilers glided along the line. And he gets in the lane to block that. All sorts of pressure here in the offensive end. They are really applying the squeeze. Look at this. They've got the cycle in full effect now. Puck's cooked up against the glass. And it's picked up by the D. Puck scooped up by Robinson. Huge stop by Campbell. Moves it to Kane. Quick shot! Oh, solid save by Merzlikens! Quick pass to Hyman. Puck picked up by Bean. Poked away at center by Nurse. Here's a short pass to Fogel. Edmonton got the puck against the wall. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And we'll get a face-off after the offside call. Dreisaitl's good at moving the play along when he distributes the puck with solid, firm passes that his teammates can handle, guys. He just loves setting them up with his tape-to-tape -tape zone ability. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Off a stick and they can't connect. Here we go, puck's in deep. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Sends the pass in front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Quick feed to Yamamoto. Enters the offensive zone from the left. And that caroms off a body in the lane. Columbus moves it quickly along the wing. Sends it in on the attack. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Looks to make a play over to Dreisaitl. Moves it to McDavid. And the puck dies with the trapper save. 
Quick hands, not only does he get a glove on it, he catches it, which is hard to do. Here in the back half of this period, it's all tied up. The Blue Jackets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Now he takes it over the line. Edmonton's got possession of the puck. Couldn't complete the play. Into the middle of the neutral zone. Edmonton's got control of it now from their own end. The Oilers gain control of the puck. Takes the feed from his own end. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Puts it in deep. The Oilers scoop it up along the boards. Take it along the wall by Murray. Slides the puck across to Yanmark. Oh, and they probably want to redo on that. Pass across to Boquist. The Blue Jackets are in transition. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. Through center. Centering in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. Just here in the late stages of this frame, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Edmonton's won the faceoff. Here's a blast. Flashes the leather. What a save by Merzlikens. Feeds the puck to Robinson. Can't make the connection on the pass. Poked away in the neutral zone by Bemstrom. The Oilers take it from the side. Scores! The go-ahead goal! Uh, this game has been tight. Now somebody's got a leg up. Edmonton's gone ahead by one. Now what's the strategy late in the second period shouldn't here? Uh, shouldn't change at all, sorry, James, because you've got the lead. Doesn't mean you sit back. Take it into the break right the same way. Makes sense. Corrales gained possession inside the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to Robinson. Takes a shot. Oh, what a block. He'll get a pat on the back from the coach when he gets off, if he can get off. Moves it over to Ryan. And a good, solid hit on that play. Here he is, wrestling on net. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Into the offensive zone. Columbus gains a hold of it. Slides the puck over to Goodbranson. Looks to pass it to Corrali. Poked away at center by Clefbaum. The Blue Jackets looking against the half wall. Slides the pass over to Hyman. Feeds the puck across to Clefbaum. Quick pass across to Sillinger. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. Edmonton's got possession at center. And less than a minute to go here in the middle frame. Grabbed along the board by Puyo Yarvi. Decides to go to the backhand. And a solid save on the play there. And it's a quick pass to Bouchard. Columbus will take it from their own end with time winding down. Edmonton's got the puck here in the open ice. And now he tries to get it across to Kane. The Blue Jackets take it across the line. Easy peasy right there by Campbell. If you're gonna leave a rebound, it might as well be 30 feet away from the net. That's a really good stop because the puck's out of danger. There's the buzzer bringing the second period to an end. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports. And we've got a third period just around the corner. James Sabalski and Ray Ferraro set to call the action for you. They have dropped the puck here in the third. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? The Blue Jackets haven't tested that goaltender really much at all. A low number of shots means very few scoring chances. They're lucky this game is close. Edmonton's got the puck in the defensive end. 
Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Goudreau. Quick pass to Dreisaitl. Big save. Picked up along the wall by Rosovic. Knocked away by Nurse. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. And that's broken up. Here's a chance. Pad save. He's on it tonight. Here's a short pass to Rosovic. Columbus moves it ahead. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck. The Blue Jackets gain possession and tries to make a diagonal pass to Boquis. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Dished on over to Goudreau. And he slides it quickly to Sillinger. Takes the puck at the point. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Sillinger. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Sends the pass in front. He scores! are now up by two in the third. Really have played a good game to this point, and now you want to make sure that you continue to play in the same style. Puck is dropped, and play resumes. Quick feed to Kane. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Gavrikov. Hooked away in the neutral zone. Pushes it across to Sillinger. Bouchard stick handling in his own zone. The Oilers take it across the blue line. A feed out front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Merce Lickens feels the need to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Well, this game is, is starting to run itself down towards the end. A, a mistake now would be a dangerous one. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. The Oilers now lead by two. Back to the blue line. Love side save. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Fogel. The Blue Jackets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Moves it to Johnson. Look out, a two-on-one. Campbell's gonna pounce on it, and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, and so the opportunity to kill the play, he's gonna take it. Both teams readying here for the faceoff. Ryan's won a big draw on their own end. Bouchard's moving the puck through his own zone. That's moved up ahead. Columbus has it in their own zone. The Blue Jackets move it in. Moves it quickly over to Bemstrom. Scooped up along the wall by Corrali. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Sends it quickly to Hyman. Great cross-ice pass. Wax it into the offensive zone. Slides it diagonally to Robinson. Takes the cross-ice pass. Good Branson's taking it from his own end. And now it's over to Bemstrom. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Now over to Corrali. Taken by Robinson. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. Scrum along the boards. Takes the pass in the offensive zone. He grabs the puck here at the point. And he slides it quickly to Bokvis. Handles the puck. Edmonton's gained possession. Slides it over with pace to Yanmark. Poked away at center ice. Puck grabbed by Bean. Fires it, and he makes the save. Campbell's gonna slow things down and up for the whistle. Oh, you gotta kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Oilers lead it 4-2. Columbus wins the draw here in the offensive zone. Pass broken up. Quick pass to Nyfist. Puts it on net. Here he is in close. Campbell's gonna hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James, he needed a cover there. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Edmonton's got it in the defensive zone. Campbell's got the puck and he's gonna hang on.
Johnson's won the draw here in the offensive zone. And he says no! Campbell's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Columbus will go to work here in the offensive end. Denies the shooter on that play. Nugent Hopkins wins the draw inside his defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Pugliarvi. Moves the puck along the half wall. And now it's grabbed by Wierenski. From right out of midair, he bats it down. Takes it and looks ahead. Quick feed to Johnson. Tries to the crease. Oh, he keeps it out with a great reactionary stop with the toe. The Oilers move to the offensive zone. Receives the pass. Picked up along the boards by Peak. Handles it along the blue line. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Directs it on over to Dreisaitl. Takes a shot, and he gets just enough of it to keep it out for the back of the net. Oh, and another quick stop. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. It's 4-2. Edmonton's won the draw. Moves it to Yamamoto. Great left save. Merzlikens has played so well tonight, but it really doesn't matter if the guys at the other end don't start scoring some goals. More than half the frame has been played here. We've got ourselves a 4-2 hockey game. Edmonton's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Gets it over to Line A. The Blue Jackets take it along the wall. Stopped by the goaltender. Moves it quickly over to Roslevic. The Oilers have it behind the net. Edmonton's across the blue line. Puck scooped up by Yamamoto. Made the stop on the play. Now he looked up to the roof after that one. He thought he had room. The goaltender makes the stop. It's a contact sport, people. There's proof right there. Poked away in the neutral zone by McDavid. Saucer pass. And just like that, from out of nowhere, comes up with the puck. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. The Oilers will play the puck from the back of the net. Edmonton's got it along the wall. Puck dumped in deep, allowing for the defenseman to change. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. The Blue Jackets will play it against the wall. Takes that pass back at the point. And he takes the pass. Blocked by the defender, nice play. And that pass doesn't go. Taken along the wall by Gavrikov. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Borchek. Oh, the home team is reeling here inside the defensive zone, and the fans are nervous. D picks it up. They are under pressure here. And now he moves it to Yanmar. Slides the puck over. The Blue Jackets carry it along the wall. Puck picked up by Murray. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Great read with the stick. Taken by Sillinger. On the attack along the boards. Here he is from the slot. The Oilers have it against the wall. Kulak swinging the puck through center ice. Pass to Corrali. Here they come on the attack. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. Corrali's got the green light to try this move almost anywhere on the ice. The coaches have great faith in his ability, but he just can't complete it. Dumps it into the O-zone. The Oilers will play the puck from behind the net. Tries to get it to Kulak. Can't find his man. 
Grabbed along the boards by Kane. From the open ice, they gain the line. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Goodbranson. Kane's got control of the puck in the corner. The Blue Jackets will play it from the defensive zone. Moves the puck. And now he angles it across to Bemstrom. And offside, we'll get a reset here. Here in the later stages of this period, the Oilers have some breathing room as they lead by a pair. It's 4-2. Edmonton's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Feeds it on over to McDavid. And that's deflected. Columbus is across the line and on the attack. Went for the dirty dangle, and it goes sideways. Johnson's close to pulling off a great move there. Just denied in zone. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Nurse has got it along the boards. Into the corner now. Stays with it. Stops it with the glove. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Edmonton's got it, and they're on the attack. Quick pass to Kane. Club save. Kane's able to deliver the puck to the net here. He's been out with an injury, and so I wondered if he was going to be able to be sharp in his first game back. Face off looming as both centers get into position. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. The Oilers have it now. Picked up along the wall by Hyman. From the boards, he takes that pass. Oh, it's denied by Merzlikens. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Ryan. To the low slot. And that doesn't reach the net. The Oilers take it along the wing. Here's a short pass to Fogel. Shoots it. Turns that one away. The Blue Jackets scoop it up along the boards. This has been a pretty tough shift for him, banged up in the middle of it. Now he's got to hobble his way to the bench. Hopefully they'll get the door open and he can get in and get some help from the trainer. Inside of the final minute here in the third. The Blue Jackets gain control of the puck against the wall. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Hammers the shot. Oh, how did that stay out? What a save by Campbell. They talk about tracking the puck all the time. I think it's about positioning because he didn't see this, and he still made the save. The Blue Jackets pick up steam and are on the attack. Puck grab by Bouchard. Quick feed to Clefbaum. Fails to find the open man. The Blue Jackets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Final seconds of this one, and the home fans certainly appreciate that they got their money's worth tonight. Moves it to Kavrikov. There it is, final horn sounds. We are all over here with this one. This is a very confident squad right now, and they are on a good earth. Uh, you can always see it, too. When a team feels really good about themselves, they get down a goal or two, and it doesn't seem to matter. They, they feel like the answer is in their locker room all the time. And here's another two points on the board. For my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, my name is James Cebulski. Thanks so much for joining us. Good night.